friends, how are you doing? It's your girl Grace, aka Face Quizit here, and today I'm coming at you with this gorgeous, gorgeous eye makeup tutorial that I'm rocking. This gorgeous purple eyes. I absolutely love purple. If you know me, you know I love purple, okay? I've been trying to stay away from purple, but it keeps calling me, it keeps calling me, and I can't resist it. So I yield it to its call. Oh dear. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, today I'm coming at you with this gorgeous purple um eye makeup tutorial and nude lips. And today I decided I wanted to use all OPV um products. Um OPV, I believe I mean, I know they're a UK company. They haven't asked me to do this, they don't know I'm doing it, they don't even know me. <laughs> I'm just impressed by them. I like their products. I like their customer service. Um, I've heard a lot about them, so I thought, let me try it out. I ordered my products last week, Tuesday. Guess what? It came the following day. How impressive is that? I was very impressed, okay? Um, and to top it all off, when I swatched um, their um, products, I was sold. I was sold. I mean, if you follow me on Snapchat, you will see that I did swatch these products, and now I am, you know, using their products on my face so that you can see the quality of this product and to think they are so reasonable. I mean, I'm loving this highlighter. Stardust Divas, I love it, you know? I'm rocking the purple on my eyes, it's OPV, the, the highlighter is OPV and my lips, this um, liquid um, lipstick I'm rocking is OPV and I have to tell you, I am very, very impressed. I hardly, you know, use one product in my videos. I'm going to start doing that a lot more. Um, but yeah, for, for a product that's so reasonable to come out looking this fabulous, I am very, very impressed. So yeah, it's all about OPV today. Of course, I'm going to use other products, but the main areas that I'm highlighting are all OPVC. Sorry, OPV. <laughs> I believe that I'll put the details and the link um, in my description box in the description box below so do check it out um, but yeah like I said no one's asked me to do this I bought this with my own money um, I was just simply blown away by the quality and um, also the fact that it was quite reasonable and a good customer service that I thought you know I'm going to use it on this next tutorial and I'm gonna shout out you know I believe it's an up-and-coming company um, and they need support just as much as, you know, any other big guru out there. So I am shouting out OPV. I believe their OPV lashes on Instagram and their, OP, their website is opvhair.com. But anywho, I will leave the details in the description box below. So do check them out, especially for those of you who are based in the UK and are looking, you, you know, you're looking for some way to get good quality products. They are a winner, okay, divas? Um, yeah, that's it, really. Um, let's stop talking. Let's get into this tutorial. Oh, and before I do that, I must not forget to give the shout-out of the week. And the shout-out for this week is going to none other than Yeti Tube. Yes, diva, thank you so, so much. You, have, you are another diva that's been there from the get-go. I really appreciate you. You keep coming back. You keep leaving words of encouragement. Thank you so much, diva. You know, I do appreciate you so, so, so much. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, so that's it for this week, Yeti Tube. You never know who it's going to be next week, so stay tuned. All right, viewers, without further ado, let's get into this tutorial. Okay, so my face has already been prepped and primed, hence the whitish look. So now I'm going to prep, um, prime my eyes with Soft Ochre Paint Pot by MAC, and I'm just applying this using um, a Sigma... Uh, brush. Uh, I can't remember what this one's called. I'll put the details in the description box below. I'm just applying the um, soft ochre all over my eyes. Now I'm grabbing the E27 brush by Morphe and I'm applying my very first crease color which is in form of Frappe by Makeup Geek and I'm just applying this into my crease and taking it upwards. Next color I'm applying is Simply Marlena which is also by uh, Makeup Geek and that is going to go in my crease but not as high as the frappe that I applied initially. Now I'm taking the E28 um, brush also by um, Morphe brushes and I'm going in with um, Cherry Cola. 
And I'm going to be depositing this color into my inner and the inner and outer corner of my eyes because we're going for like a halo spotlight look. It's going to make the um, center color pop a bit more. So I'm just depositing that color into the inner corners and the outer corners of my eyes, Divas. And I just, you know, blending it out a bit with the E27. Now I'm going in with Americano and I'm still sticking with the inner and outer corner of my eyes. And it's the same principle. Um, this Americano is not going to go as high as the Simply Melena. And now I'm taking this Black by Makeup Geek, which is Corrupt. And I'm taking a soft um, shader brush and I'm applying that black on top of the Americano but not taking it as high as the Americano. The fluffy brush just gives me a bit more control. I, I think I prefer it to the pencil brush which is a bit stiffer. Anyway, I'm going back in with the um, soft ochre now and I'm just applying some in the mid section of my lid which is where the um, main color for today is going. And um, it's from this gorgeous palette. It's called the Gorgeous Palette by OPV. And I'm taking this purple, which I absolutely love, and I'm just packing that on top of the um, soft ochre that I had deposited earlier. It's like a violet color as, a, as opposed to a grape purple. It's really gorgeous. Love it. And I'm just packing this on with a, I think it's an E, or oh, I can't remember. I'll put it in the description, but that's a Sigma brush. Now I'm grabbing that E27 brush. I'm just fading out. Um, you know those colors making it blend together seamlessly and now I'm applying um, peach smoothie by makeup geek in as I'm applying it onto my brow bone as my um, highlight color I'm just fading it out a bit more with that e27 just to make sure the colors mesh together now I'm applying my um, eyeliner any black eyeliner would do and now I'm applying um, Feline by MAC soft core pencil into my waterline, um, both my upper and lower waterline. And now I'm taking this um, Absolute Mink um, lashes, which I've applied off camera anyway. I've applied that in um, Devon. And I've applied um, Coke, Cherry Cola underneath my eyes um, sparingly. And now I'm going back with that um, purple and I'm applying that into the center of my under eye using this um, synthetic brush. I sprayed it with Fix Plus just to grab the color a bit more. And I'm just popping that under the center of my eyes just to open up my eyes a bit more. Now I'm grabbing um, Apricot Sorbet Blusher by The Makeup Store, which is my absolute favorite blusher, and I've applied that. And now I'm grabbing OPV Highlighter in Stardust, and oh my god i had to douse my face in it divas everywhere that catches the light i put this thing on i love it anywho onto the lips i'm um, lining my lips with cork lip liner by mac cosmetics um just following the natural shape um of my lips and now i'm grabbing pucker up liquid lipstick by opv um, it's an OPV day today, Divas, and I'm just applying this um, all over my lips, just building it up gradually. And you know me, I like to define my lips because otherwise they just look too, I don't know, they look funny. I feel like they look just like they're so big, even though they're not that big, I don't think. But if I don't define my lips, I just don't like how they look. So I've gone back in. Now, we all know it's not a good idea to try and put a lip liner on liquid lipstick but I'm doing it anyway and here we have it divas this is the final look I absolutely love 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 this look beautiful well done OPV I love so it. here you have it divas this is the final look I hope you like it I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial as much as I've enjoyed creating it if you have go ahead and hit that thumbs up button okay divas also if you have any comments go ahead and leave it in the comment box below and if need be I'll come back to you if not then thank you anyway for watching this video for visiting my channel you know I don't take it for granted I really do appreciate you divas thank you also don't forget to hit that subscribe button let's achieve that goal of 20k which I have set for this year i know we can do it with you on my side and god on my side 
the sky is the limit divas so yeah go ahead and hit that subscribe button also don't forget to share this video divas share it on all your social media platforms i really appreciate that you know just hit that share button and share it <laughs> that's all it is just share it and i'd really 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 appreciate that divas thank you so 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 much don't forget to follow your um, girl on social media and face squeezed on all my social media networks except for um, my Facebook page, which is Grace Face Squizzit Makeup Artist, and my LinkedIn page, which is just Grace Ibukunlua. Um, and that's it, Divas. Thank you so, so much. Until next time, Divas, stay absolutely fabulous. And remember, Jesus loves you, and I love you too. See you, Divas. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.